y'all. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm back with another video. Two more week. Well, yeah, I know. More content for you guys because I love, love, love doing this. So I'm making a protein shake starting off my day right. I got some almond milk because the water yesterday with the protein shake was bad. More plant protein. Still the same flavored vanilla because I'm scared to try the chocolate one right now. Dab, 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 dab. Um, I'm going with just two scoops because maybe it won't taste like powder if I just do two scoops. Okay, okay, put it in there. Right, right, right. Just eight ounces because I'm following the instructions to a T today. Trying to make some quality improvements. Ooh, I'm adding a shot of mocha. A mocha boost to my protein shake. Why? Because sis is trying to be a health queen. I'm trying to be fit. I'm trying to look good, feel good. That's why I'm making this complicated drink. Uh, I couldn't open the mocha. This is me struggling to open that little boost package. Okay. Okay, here we go. It's gonna work out for y'all. <laughs> Don't worry. I will open. Okay, gotta open. Yay! Yeah, pour it in, pour it in, pour it in. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, that's our protein mixture. Let's get together. Let's get the mix in. Mix, 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 mix. Alright, so after all that mi mixing up the ingredients, putting it all in there, it's time to shake it up. Shake it up like you got to ask me. Shake it up like he doing an ASMR video. Shake it up like it's not gonna taste like powder after you shake it up. <laughs> Just keep going, just keep shaking, just keep shaking, just keep shaking, just keep shaking. Yum, 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 yum. I'm so excited to drink this nasty drink. Alright, so I did all that work for a reason. It's time to actually drink the protein and feel good about ourselves. Pretend that it tastes good. Sip, sip, sip. Yum. That's right, you guessed it. I finished it. I finished my protein. I finished it. I finished it. I finished it for you. Transition to the next clip. Bam. Okay, health queen. What are we doing next? So you had your protein. Now you want to get your mouth nice and minty and fresh. Wash that nasty taste out your mouth because you are not skinny yet. Okay, got some Colgate. Mmm. What are we doing? Putting on our toothbrush right now. Okay. Okay, go off. That is toothpaste. I wet the brush before I put the toothpaste. Do you wet the brush after you put the toothpaste? Or do you not wet your toothbrush at all? Let me know because there was a whole thing about this. I think it's weird not to wet the toothbrush, honestly. Um, I'm scrubbing my teeth. That's a little sound audio if you, if you like the sound of that. And then I'm going real fast now. The outsides, the insides, the outsides, the inside, the tops, the bottoms, the gums. All around. Ooh, the tongue. Don't forget the tongue, sis. People say if you don't brush the tongue, you're going to have bad breath anyways. That is nasty. Okay, so I'm scrubbing my teeth. I'm trying to be fresh. Trying to trying to live my best hot girl summer the only way I know how to. <laughs> uh, this lasts for a long time, so it's real fast because we need fresh breath. It's not debatable. It's not negotiable. We want to smell good. All right, so this is me trying to make one of those commercials where they do the weird, the real quick splash and their face is magically cleaned. Um, This is a product I use. Mm, pose for the thumbnail and hold it. Hold it. Yes, yes, queen. Okay. I like it because it's foaming and it's uh, really simple and my skin feels great after. Um, scrub, 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 scrub. <laughs> so basically I just wet my hands on my face and then I uh, get to work. I got this cool little exfoliator thing that I don't even use often but I was like, you know, why not use it right now? And then it's I technically rubbed off my um, dead skin and then I just pat dry and then bam, 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 clean face. So when you're all done trying to make your own commercial splashing water all over the place, make sure you clean up after yourself because... No one likes someone who's gross. And everyone who lives with you will be annoyed with you. And also, your dog is going to attack the Swiffer for way too long, making it harder to clean, but also much more fun. All right, disclaimer, disclaimer. Um, I'm not a beauty guru. I have no idea what I'm doing with makeup. I just want my skin to look, you know, natural and good and smooth. Even though my natural skin's already pretty lit, I just like to put on a little moisturizer because um, dry skin is gross, okay? We we're all aware that dry skin is nasty. Um, rub it in. Be extra. Massage your face. Get that deep clean going. I'm also um, just getting ready for my first day of work and I wanted to make a good first impression since I was meeting new people. Um, I don't know. Double up on the moisturizer, you know? They always say double up. Maybe you want your skin to be extra ultra soft. Maybe you think someone's gonna be petting your face. Really just not trying to be ouchy out there in the streets, dude. Like, Ashy dry skin does not look cute, plain, and does not look cute under makeup. Alright, on to the next thing. I got some Too Faced foundation because the other foundation ran out on the homie gave me this one. Shout out to you, Cheyenne. Um, it's it's a matte foundation. It kind of comes on a little bit too early for me, but then I just go in with my um, a setting powder later. Um, a dab, a dab there, that there, you know. Nobody wants dry nose. Mmm, mmm. 
I think the color match is actually perfect because when I blend this, like, where did it go? I don't know. Disappeared. Maybe I am a beauty guru. I'm just kidding. They're all quaking watching this video. Sis, grab your sponge. Get that beauty blender sponge. And then beat your face. Beat your face like a mad person. Pat, 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 pat. Ra -ta 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 -ta. All right, you honestly want to keep beating your face until you feel good about yourself, until it's blended, until your face is soft and smooth, and everything is creamy, basically, um, for all eternity. You know, blending is key. When you see that girl with streaks, you be like, sis, 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 you did not blend. All right, moving on. So I got this cool magnetic brush. Um, does it do anything cool? I don't know, but it's magnetic, so I bought it. That's my setting powder, Cover, Cover FX. Um, I love it. One time I lost it in an Uber and I had to buy a new one and I was heated because they never messaged me back. And I lost that setting spirit. And then play with your dog, you know. Sometimes he needs a little attention. We're going to go on with this NARS concealer, also magic. Um, I put concealer on top of my foundation. Is that correct or wrong? I don't know. It's the way that I do it. I like it. My face looks good, so that's what I'm doing right now. Um, you want to put some on your forehead. Da, 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 da. I got some on my nose too and my chin, you know, because people do that and it looks good. I'm going to go on with your brush. Get the brush stroke, 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 stroke. Blend, 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 blend. Yes, yes, yes. You can obviously, you know, get some um, highlight and contour and all the extra stuff, but sis, I'm trying to be on time to my first day, not an extra 30 minutes late because. First of all, that takes me a long time, and I don't think it makes a difference, or I probably do it wrong. I don't know. I don't know. That was my setting powder. Alright, so I just like to use the setting powder to make everything actually, like, stay on my face all day and not rub off when I touch my face and be all gross. Um, honestly, let me just tell you guys that when I was doing this, I spilled a bunch on my bed and my computer. But luckily, I did not get it on my shirt, so I was still in the process of getting ready to go. So, since it's like a pressed powder, you know, the one that has the, um, like, the holes in the <laughs> container and stuff. I, I know you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Um, it gets a little messy sometimes, which is a little annoying, honestly. Uh, I'm swooping the brush through there. Um, Leo is biting me. That's my puppy. He, um, he likes to bite. I don't like to be bitten. That's that. Okay, so continuing on beating my face, I'm still using the setting powder. Because um, it was not blending out well. That's, there's some brown streaks on my face where you can see the color change. It looks bad. If you notice that your makeup's not blended, take the extra time and just blend it. Because people outside will for sure notice that you have streaks. Alright, so we're going to start finishing off the look right now. This is my Urban Decay uh, mascara. I love it, love it, love it. Because first of all, it's really black and thick. And it also does a lot of lifting. Because look, you can't even see my lashes right now. By the end of this, I'm going to be lifted and flying. You're going to be shook. I'm not sure if this is a thing for you guys, but it's definitely a thing for me to try to make the lashes. Even with the other side. Usually, the left side... Oh, my God. Usually, the left side comes out on the right side. Be somehow messed up. So, don't panic. Get the lash curler, girl, because you know it looks bad. You know you messed up. I don't even like to use this thing. It honestly gives me anxiety that, like, my lashes are all going to be yanked out by the lace front. And I don't know what to do. I just want them to be nice. Okay, so here's a clip that is sped up really fast because I spent way too long playing with my freaking eyelashes. Um, I honestly, like, okay, so I think... At lashes and eyebrows make your face. I don't know what I'm doing with this little tiny comb. I think I'm just trying to play because, you know, when you spend too long on them, they get clumpy. And then I just realized, like, I got some on my eyelid and who wants black lines there. So I had to get a makeup wipe and cl cleanse the palette. Start from fresh. I had to remove my mistakes, my errors, my sins, my wrongdoings. <laughs> because I was not walking out my house like that. I'm trying to make a first impression, y'all. Not be like, oh my god, who is this girl? <laughs> Why is she doing her makeup like that? So, um, after correcting those mistakes, I realized that I had some um, spots I had also wiped off of foundation and concealer. So, I'm just blending it out, making everything look consistent. And uh, just making sure that my, you can't see my real skin no more, pretty much. Um, I also wet the beauty blender because it works so much better. 
I'm still worried about the lashes, y'all. Um, what's your favorite eye? Just comment down below. The left or the right eye? Because I know, I know they're not the same. But, okay, see? The other eye is just so on point. Ah! Okay, moving forward. Moving forward. Um, what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, more mascara? Just what I needed. Oh, this is a different kind. This is a different kind. Um, this one, I'm pretty sure, is also Urban Decay. But, um... I'm just using it as a brush to smooth them all out, really, because, like, that clumpiness and having them all not all go the same way was real annoying and gross. So, this me finishing up everything. Alright, so after the setting powder and correcting those lashes, you need to go in with some spray. Um, it makes it really dewy, and it really just finishes everything off. I use the Too Faced one because, um, I don't know, I like it. That's It's as simple as that. And then I'm going in with some lip gloss because I didn't want to wear um, lipstick. I'm obviously not going to be wearing my makeup every day at this job because it's just not who I am or what I do. I'm not really a beauty guru. So I just wanted, again, some more moisture. Like how I went in heavily with that moisturizer. Ooh, the edges. The edges, sis. sis, sis. They will come for you when your edges not laid. So my hair was braided last night, obviously. Um, well, not, well, obviously, because I'm this get ready with me, the braiding part. If you missed it, I'm sorry. Comment down below and I'll film that video for you. Um, I'm just laying them down my fingers. I didn't go in with the comb or anything because they never stay down all day anyway. She's going to do what she wants. I just wanted it to be a little bit smoother than it was. And then you got to massage the gel out from where you pushed it because that looks gross. And then also, oh, I love getting those little baby hairs on my ear, making that little curl pop. Um, I kind of sometimes spend too much too long on that little curl. But, um, she's flourishing. She's growing, and she's just crawled perfectly most of the days, let me tell you. Eco Styler is your best friend. Um, just going in, laying everything down for longer, because I got time, I guess. <laughs> I started getting ready for, um, this first day pretty early, because I was a little bit anxious. But, ooh, see, I told y'all, look at that pop! Mm, mm, mm. Cute and simple. This is like my everyday thing because it's pretty easy to go to and um, people don't expect much, much from you after. Like you just look natural. You didn't beat your face for two hours. I only beat my face for like 10 minutes. And um, I obviously struggled through those 10 minutes. So that's that. There you go. Um, so obviously if you have a pet or a fur blanket like I do... Then your pants get a lot of lint on them. You just want to take that lint off, roll it away, just like you got to roll the haters out of your life. That's what you're doing with the lint. Back up off me, lint. Um, I forgot to film an outro per usual. Um, thanks for watching. I'm going to be posting videos a lot more consistently on my YouTube channel because I love you guys and I love editing and filming. So I'll see you next time. Bye.